SELP and I am back again with another product review from Trader Joe's. Today we're going to be discussing a new item that's in a new hot section, okay, of Trader Joe's. It is called the Kale and Cauliflower Chili with Navy Beans. So you guys may have seen this on the shelf. Obviously it's empty, it's gone, I, I ate it, clearly. Um, it is in a jar, but it's a soup. So that's a little confusing because, I mean, I don't know. I'm used to soups coming in something else. But they claim that if the jar is kind of shaped this way, that that's their soups during the seasons. Anyways, here nor there. It is a soup that is a vegan soup, actually. So it has the little, uh, let's see if you can see the little vegan stamp there. So all your vegans you can enjoy this too okay it is literally just diced tomatoes diced puree um kale cauliflower navy beans and then just a little bit of spices like the basic little spices now the trick to this thing that makes it different when you try it is that it does have agave syrup now not a whole lot it's listed at the bottom of the ingredients so there's not a whole lot of it but it is enough in there that it balances all the other spices and you taste that like savory and then you taste a bit of the sweet and it's just a hint of sweet it's not crazy but it's like that nice little that little like nice little touch to it so check out my initial reaction while i prepare this dish hey y'all so i'm deciding to cook this kale soup with some ground turkey just because it is vegetarian style um and i already had some ground turkey ready to go so i'm going to add that with it and it's a simple meal it's already prepared all you have to do is just heat up the soup so I'm gonna brown the ground turkey and then mix it on together so the soup already has stuff in it it already has like chili paprika um parsley cumin a little bit of cinnamon black pepper um and some other spices so i'm not gonna put too much of um stuff in the ground turkey just because i don't want to make it too crazy but you know sometimes trader joe's need a little bit of extra extra something something going on so what i am going to add is um let me show you i'm gonna add some of this Ajika Georgian, which I did a review on that, so y'all can go back and check that out. And I like to go based off of smell because I'm already smelling what this soup's gonna kind of possibly taste like, and so just adding a little bit of that. And I have some spices that I get kind of in bulk um, from this Armenian store um, next to my house. And this is cayenne pepper, so I put it inside of its own little shaker. And so I'm gonna just add a little bit of that just because I like to have a little bit of a a little bit of a kick, a little spice spice to it. So I'm just adding that. Um and right now I'm just browning the meat and then I'm just gonna add the soup in it. So here is the meat. I just added only a little bit of um the spice to it let it get a little bit brown and then i'll show y'all what it looks like uh as a final product okay y'all it is nice and ready nice and hearty it smells delicious y'all like it smells really good it smells like a nice little fall situation okay so you saw what i thought about it it ended up turning out way better than I honestly thought. Now, when I saw it on the shelf in the store, I was just like, kale, cauliflower, chili with navy beans. I was like, okay, well, clearly it's a veggie soup. That's fine. I eat meat, but you can always throw meat into something, you know, super easy. And I was just like, I don't know, but it sounds pretty hearty. And when you look at the jar, the substance of it looks pretty hearty, as you can see in the video. So I was like, all right, this is going to be good. And I thought about it, and I it was perfect because I already had, as I said, I think it was the ground um, turkey or chicken or whatever it was I already had. It was already ready. So I put it in there, and baby, bomb, 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 as you saw in the video, uh, clip 
it was really really good to the point that I actually went to Trader Joe's today and I bought two more of these because it's such a quick dish it's literally all you need to do is just heat it up it stores in a dry place but you refrigerate it after you know you open it and it gives you easy microwave and stove top instructions honey there ain't no cooking to this this is an easy one two bang meal it's already fall we all know how soups and all this stuff start to become a thing this season get you some honey get you some okay so get down to trader joe's try this out i promise you vegans vegetarians people that eat meat pescatarian whatever all of the above y'all will enjoy this let me know what you think.